know what to do, fam. It's your boy, Dietrich Haddon, hanging out right here on Embryo Music, the biggest internet gospel. It's, it's going crazy, man. God bless you. I want to say hey to everybody out there that's uh, logging on, that know what's popping. It's your boy, you know, Dietrich Haddon, hanging out here. What to do, fam? What to do? Tell me what's up. To come from way back then, this is my story, live the life, chain breaker, all the way to blessed and cursed years, to have longevity like I've been in the business. People call me probably the, the youngest veteran or uh, gospel legend, man. Uh, I'm honored, really. I'll tell you the truth. I'm really humbled to be able to have been in the business this long. And people still think I'm some new guy, fresh guy on the scene. Uh, I'm really humbled. And uh, I feel a sense of uh, responsibility that it's 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 that I have the responsibility of making sure that I show the future of gospel how far we can go, how far we can take this gospel without losing God's anointing and without losing God's favor, All right? Because there there's a level you can tap in where you go entirely too far over the top. You're so created that you miss God. So it was my responsibility through my prayer and fasting, understanding of the word, and understanding of God's creativity that it's my responsibility. I'm just one of those to show you how aggressive and progressive we need to be production-wise, sonically, and artistically. That's why I call my brand new CD, Church on the Moon. It's very creative. It's very fresh. It's, it's, it's all about, uh, uh, you know, doing something that's out of this world, taking the gospel out of the earth's atmosphere into the heavenlies, and doing something that will stand out and show the future of, of the gospel how far we can go. And uh, I, I consider myself to be a foundation. Like, a foundation may not be the most biggest, you know, situation. The foundation is what everything else is built, built on. The foundation shows you the parameters on how far you can build, how, you know, how far you can go. And the thing about it is the, a, a foundation it's something that will be walked on. It's something that your know, people build on. It's not the, the, it don't get the limelight, it don't get the big, you know, the visibility, but because it's there, it's the reason why we're standing on something, on, on an establishment. So uh, I consider myself one of the uh, foundations of contemporary gospel music. So, hey, no big deal. I don't have to be the one that's all in front. I just want to play my part in making sure that the kingdom of God, the contemporary gospel music, stand strong and represent uh, the culture. It's Dietrich and B.O.U. I felt like taking it back old school, y'all. Uh, I mean, I've always uh, had a passion for the movies. Actually, about uh, at least about 16, 17 years ago, I was in the sanctuary at my church praying, asking God, like, what am I really supposed to do? Like, how am I going to contribute to this? I want to. I really want to play a part in this. And God spoke to me and said that people would sing my songs, that he would give me songs that the world would sing. And God has been faithful concerning that word. Also in that prayer time, he told me that I would be able to tell stories and, and do movies. And back then, man, I don't know nothing about, I didn't know anything about a film other than paying my money to sit down and watch a film. I always love movies. Like, that's what I do. I sit down and watch all the movies. And so I've always uh, been intrigued by it. And then God told me that I would lead people. And I jumped up in that prayer session and ran and told my girlfriend, she was Demita at the time, you know, Demita, she's my girlfriend. And, she, and I said, Demita, God said, we're going we gonna to sing, we gonna, people going to sing our songs and we're going to do movies. And she was like, okay, whatever, okay, what, what are we going to do about it, you know? And then, so we set out uh, writing songs and God just started doing what he promised, really. And here is, uh, years later, the, the promise, the next phase of our ministry coming to pass. How do we get this film done? Man, I don't know. It was miraculous because we didn't have a big budget. But if you look at it, it looked like we spent millions of dollars. And the people that are in it, I mean, we couldn't. It, it took a miracle for us to get all these great gospel artists to be a part of this. So it was miraculously done. 
and which lets me know when it's out of your control and out of your power, that means God has everything to do with it. And so that's why we're in the, the movie business now. So now we're going full-fledged with it. We have, we're going into production with our next two. The next film is called King. And then Demita got a uh, movie that's crazy for the sisters called Woodward. It's going to be bananas. And, uh, hey, that's what we're doing. We might as well do it. I think uh, you got to see this movie. First of all, those that are in the kingdom, you got to get it in your collection just because you're representing the kingdom of God. You're supporting something that was birthed from the kingdom, not the world, not Hollywood, not all this. It was birthed from the body of Christ. So I need you, whether you like the film or not, you may not like it. You need to support it anyway because you got to support a kingdom, uh, a kingdom project. You got to do it, man. And that's the only way we can continue to do things like this where we can do it outside of the world system. So we need your support. So if you don't have and you watching me right now, you got to stop. Order it online at www.blessandcursethemovie.com. It's all in the bookstores, Walmart, and everything in the U.S. In the U.K., it's in all your Christian outlets now through Kingsway. Uh, if you're in Ireland, I just came back from Dublin. Uh, it's in all your scripture union bookstores. Or just order it online. you got to get it because it represents us. It's your brothers and sisters that are kingdom brothers and sisters that are gospel artists that are doing something that has never be d been done before. This is the first of its kind, or one of the first of its kind, and we got to support it so it can keep getting bigger and bigger and bigger. I expect in the next five to ten years that we will have the biggest uh, movie studio uh, that, that was established in the kingdom that will be producing movies that other people have written. Uh, we'll, be, we'll be producing other uh, gospel kingdom uh, movie stars where we won't have to worry about the world trying to get trying to uh, compromise we're doing it right here in the kingdom but first it start with your support right now all right then if you continue to support I, I guarantee you in the next five and maybe sooner we'll be doing it big like big production movies like Lord of the Rings and Matrix and all these movies we can do it man I'm telling you, it, it starts with one seed, one seed, and then you spreading it out, it, and it becomes bigger and bigger and bigger, and you look up, man, we are doing a really big for the kingdom, and God will get the glory. I'm going to make sure that, that God will get the glory out of what we do. B-O-U, I got a new praise for you. So, uh, I'm going to wrap it up here. I know I can't take up all the time, but uh, it's your boy hanging out on Embryo. Got to give a shout out to Adam and Matt. And Embryo, God bless you for doing a real big, one of the hottest internet uh, outlets, uh, social networks is, is, is doing a real big. God bless you. In order to get the movie Blessed and Cursed, go to www.blessedandcursedthemovie.com. Hey, and, and I need you to support Church on the Moon. I need you to get it. There's some great songs in it, on there like Well Done. You should already be hearing it on the radio. Mighty God, with a mighty God we serve is already blazing. There's a song on there called Let Your Healing Virtue Flow that's going crazy. One more chance. Everybody's on it. I got a record. Oh, I got to tell you all this before I go. Can you imagine a song with me? Jay Moss, Ty Tribbett, Canton Jones on one record called Reppin' the Kingdom. It's going crazy. Trust me. The UK version of Reppin' the Kingdom coming your way is about to be crazy in other words we're building the kingdom it's not about the u.s not about the uk it's about the kingdom the global kingdom of god that we're doing and we're building on the earth god bless y'all love y'all gotta go now peace yo what it do fam it's your boy dietrich Haddon hanging out right here on embryo music the biggest internet gospel it's it's going crazy man god bless you i want to say hey to everybody out there Yo, what it do, fam? It's your boy, Dietrich Haddon, hanging out right here on Embryo Music, the biggest internet gospel. It's, it's going crazy, man. God bless you. I want to say hey to everybody out there that's uh, logging on, that know what's popping. It's your boy, you know, Dietrich Haddon, hanging out here. What it do, fam? What it do? Tell me what's up.
I'm up for blood. Oh man, to come from way back then, this is my story, live the life, chain breaker, all the way to blessed and cursed years, to have longevity like I've been in the... Yo, what it do fam, it's your boy Dietrich Haddon hanging out right here on Embryo Music, the biggest internet gospel, it's, it's going crazy man, God bless you, I want to say hey to everybody out there that's uh, logging on, that know what's popping, it's your boy, you know Dietrich Haddon hanging out here, what it do fam, what it do, tell me what's up. Oh man, to come from way back then, this is my story, live the life, chain breaker, all the way to blessed and cursed years, to have longevity like I've been in the business. People call me probably the, the youngest veteran or uh, gospel legend, man. Uh, I'm honored, really, I'll tell you the truth. I'm really humbled to be able to have been in the business this long. And people still think I'm some new guy, fresh guy on the scene. Uh, I'm really humbled. 